The Tungara Valley is mostly family farms. We've got, you know, I think as many sunny days as they do in California, so we can grow almost anything here. It holds the, the key to our future. At the same time, though, we've got these high saline waters that are coming down from the coal and the coal bed methane. Keeping the water clean and the air clean is very important to agriculture and, and what we do. Oh, we bought our ranch in 1991. It's a real beautiful area. We've got lots of water and the grass is good for the cattle, but it's, it's also a challenge with water quality, you know, keeping everything going. You know, we've had a lot of challenges with the coal bed methane industry. They're wanting to, to dump water into the Tongue River that was high in salinity. The salinity in the water, it's high in sodium bicarbonate. On certain types of soil, it can basically seal up the soil and make it real difficult to get water to the root zone. That's what happened with coal bed methane to some of the farms down close to Miles City. They basically were irrigating with the water and the soils started sealing up and their yields started going down dramatically. You know, we have to watch the water quality a lot closer than we used to. We have to look at the gauging stations and see what the water quality is before we irrigate. And even though we have a water right, we may not be able to use that water. So it's, it's impeding our, our water rights as well. The water is critical in eastern Montana and that's, that's where it's going to hit us.